Oh, hello, this is Tak Chung from Walk with Tak. Welcome to my YouTube channel. And if you enjoyed this video, uh, please like, subscribe, and share. Uh, please feel free to write to me at walkwithtak.gmail.com uh, if you have any question regarding to this video or any video that I have posted in the past. Now, today I would like to answer a question that a viewer asked me about the walk spatula. And uh, he said, I watch you uh, in your cooking on your channel, you always use a standstill walk spatula. He said, I have been using a wood uh, pedal most of the time, and uh, I wonder, do I need to switch to a stainless steel wall spatula? Because it looks like what you are doing, it seems like a lot of fun. So I want to uh, use this video and talk about a stainless steel wall spatula that I've used for quite some time. Uh, first of all, that uh, it is much more fun uh, to stir fry with a wok spatula. Now, a wok spatula has been designed uh, for a long time over uh, the history of uh, stir frying in China. So it is a try and test uh, utensil for stir frying. And actually, it makes it far more fun when you have a wok spatula. And the reason is that it is designed specifically for stir frying. And if you don't have one, you miss out quite a bit of the fun that you can have. And the second thing is that it is more efficient in stir frying. Uh, it allows you uh, to stir fry your content much more efficiently because the uh, design of the wok spatula is to fit the contour of the wok as you've shown here. It can work with a uh, round bottom as well as a flat bottom wok. And uh, when you use a wok spatula, it comes far more natural in how you stir frying. And the end result is that it's not only that it is more comfortable, but it's faster. A wok spatula frequently is known as a wok chan, uh, which stands for a wok shuffle. And the reason for that is that anytime when you have a shuffle, uh, you can uh, toss the food ingredients, and this will allow you to make things much faster than otherwise possible. And because of this reason, uh, if you use a wok spatula, uh, you can stir food very rapidly. But if you don't have one, most of the time what people do is that they will have to toss the food instead. Now, a wok spatula prevents you from the doing that because it is far more efficient. And tossing food can be uh, somewhat tricky uh, unless you work in a professional restaurant and you have a wok that is uh, allow you to slide back and forth easily in a regular kitchen uh, stove that is challenging and quite often you can end up lots of things uh, on the floor. And because of this reason th that wok spatula is much better. And another important reason, number four, is that it is designed like a shovel. It is the shape of a shovel. And um, the reason for this is that because now you can turn for ingredients in a wok, which is not possible when you use a regular spatula, like as a uh, wood uh, spatula or uh, the type of spatula that do not have what I would call a specific design that will allow you, like in this case, you can see that when you cook fried rice, it is important for you not only to uh, move the rice around, but it is also much better if you can uh, use it to turn the food ingredients. Now, another important uh, attribute of the wok spatula is that you can use it to mix sauces. And the reason is that if you look at a wok spatula, which is unusual from any other spatula, it has an edge. And the end result is that it can carry fluid with it. And the consequence of that, it will allow you to mix fluids as well as food ingredients in the wok. And the end result is that um, you can make the fluid uh, to mix with the food ingredients, and which is essential in stir frying. Because stir frying uh, sauces is an important part of um, the cooking process. And a wood spatula like this just simply do not have that capacity. Now, another important role of the wok spatula is that you can use it as a scraper. Now, this is particularly true uh, when you use a wok with a natural surface. You notice that the wok spatula, the edge of the spatula is actually beveled. And the reason for that, uh, like all scraper, you can use it to scrape whatever that might stick to the bottom surface of the wok. And this makes it so much easier during uh, the cooking process, particularly if you have few things that stick in the bottom of the wok. 
Now, it is also useful for a process known as spot cleaning. Uh, in this case, what you do is that you um, put a small amount of water on the surface of the wall, and the heat will turn the water into steam, and then you can use the wall spatula to scrape off. And this is extremely efficient for cleaning during the cooking. And that's why I call it spot cleaning, because you can clean basically right on the spot. Now, another significant aspect of a wok spatula is that it has a long handle, allow you to stay away from the high heat. Because with uh, stir frying, you always, uh, most of the time, you fry, cook in relatively high heat. So in this case, you can see is that it will keep your uh, hand out of harm's way. And there are different sizes of wok spatula a 14 inch or a 16 inch. Uh, I prefer a 16 inch. The 14 inch will work, uh, but for a 14 inch wok, the 16 inch work much better. You can see in here in comparison, this is a 14 uh, inch. You, your hand is really basically over the surface of the wok. And here is a 16 inch. Your hand is outside the circumference of the wok. So from this standpoint, it makes it much safer. It keep it uh, keep your hand or harm's way. And then um, it is also easy on the arm uh, because the way how the wok spatula design with that angle, it allow you um, to stir frying with much greater ease. And you can uh, uh, hold your, uh, put your handle or hold the handle of the wok spatula at different distance. So if something that is require a lot of uh, uh, leverage, uh, you can hold it further back. If something that you want to uh, stir fry very quickly, then you can hold it closer uh, to the uh, blade. Now, uh, because the fish is standard steel, it is very easy to clean. It is something that uh, you can clean it in just a matter of uh, seconds. And this is uh, also one tremendous advantage of the stainless steel wok spatula compared to, say, a plastic or wood. And those sometimes food got stuck, make them very difficult to clean. And of course, um, the greatest aspect of this wok spatula is it's truly like a generation tool. Um, the stem of the wok spatula is actually made up of tubular steel. As you can see, uh, this provided with tremendous amount of uh, strength. And uh, this is the reason why I think a wok a spatula is something that uh, once you purchase it, you're going to have it for the rest of your life and in fact passing on to the future generations. So this is the reason why I think uh, a wok spatula is a must, uh, an essential part for stir frying. But this has to go with a wok without non-stick coating because you cannot use a wok with non-stick coating with a standard steel uh, stirrer because that will scratch the surface. And that's the reason why I always recommend people to purchase wok with non -stick code, uh, without non-stick coating with a natural surface. Not only that it will allow you to use the wok spatula, a standard steel wok spatula, but it also make it much safer in terms of not to have to worry about anything that might flake off from the non-stick uh, coating. So uh, when it comes to stir frying, Having a white wok spatula is really uh, essential and not to use also a wok with non-stick coating. Okay, so um, I want to um, help you to make home cooking part of your daily routine. The most important thing about home cooking is that you must be comfortable with both the cooking utensil that you have as well as uh, comfortable uh, that what you cook uh, will allow you to cook with spontaneity and intuition. And that is what my fast cooking system intend to be. And um, so if you like to learn more about my fast cooking system, please subscribe to this YouTube channel. So keep on cooking and I will see you tomorrow.